All right, let's get it. Let's do a bit of a deep dive on a Fontaine Specialized Traverse HT. That stands for Hydrotail Trailer. This one is equipped with a remote control. You can see the functions there. The fantastic, iconic Fontaine emblem. An 18,000 pound worn winch on the top with two lockable toolboxes. All Apatong flooring. You can see here it's got keyhole tie downs in the side rails with grippy anti-slip grip. On the side rails, we'll kind of walk through the remote control system and some of the functions. You got your hydraulic spool valve here, the winch clutch, which will free spool the winch, the tail lock right there, which is air operated, the dump valve, which will dump your suspension, work light switch, and the ramp lock, which is right there, that upper one. The bottom one is a winch, two-speed winch for an option, optional two-speed winch, which this one is not equipped with. Um, it has the fold down steps, which are actually pretty nice. So then you can access the upper deck easy peasy. Uh, has the tread plate there, hex cut tread plate and so forth. This one is equipped with airway scales. Shout out airway. They were down here last week as some of y'all may have seen shooting some of the videos. They'll be releasing that on some of their social media and on their YouTube as they go. Daniel, will you show them how to do the the ramp is hydraulically operated? So that way you can get from the lower deck to your upper deck. Great for equipment rental companies and construction companies and a bunch of others. These are 101000 roughly, depending on what options you get on it. About 101000 Dollars plus FET, 48 foot deck, 35 inch loaded deck height, and a 40 ton capacity. Scrambling around to the back, it has Hendrickson tire inflation system with an indicator light right here to alert the driver if there is a system malfunction. In other words, if it's requesting air, it has a flow sensor to let the driver know there's a flow being monitored on the tire inflation, meaning he's got a leak in one of the tires or hoses, etc. It's got the swing out lights. Can you hit the flashers, Daniel? It's got strobe lights in the back. We put the customized mini mud flaps from the best dealership ever known, TM Trailer Sales. Battery backup for the strobes. Browser bars on the ramps in the back. So Daniel's going to go ahead and hit the uh, remote control to do the hydraulic on the flip out ramp. So as he goes up, there's a little yellow bar that catches and that'll get out of the way. So when he goes back down, so he's going to go all the way up tell him, and then he hit that button to get the lock out of the way. Now he can flip the tail out. What this also does, if you have a piece of equipment on there. You can move that tail to different heights to get you to dock height. So you have the equipment already on there. Now you can get off to the dock. If you're loading from the ground, we scramble around to the back. And I think it's a 10 degree slope there that you can get any of your rental equipment, construction equipment, or just logistical uh, solutions on there. So you get that. Tail folder back up, then that yellow bar will come down to lock it in position. The also clips in right here when the when that comes out, these little locks lock the tail in place. That folding yellow bar comes down, kind of a high visibility yellow, so you can see that it will lock into place. Then that tail will come back down.